our company is uh, has many offers, so we're very well known for storage within data centers, how you virtualize that. We actually own VMware. Uh, we own technologies that enable you to take your paper, so your patient records, and digitize them and take them out of the system and, and create better care pathways. Um, we also own uh, technology, the same technology that enables um, lots of trusts who are very interested in taking their PACS archives um, and enable them to be distributed out to uh, all the users in a much more efficient and effective manner with the same set of technologies. Uh, in addition to that, we're quite unique in that we own um, a design-based consultancy that stands up websites for the likes of B&Q and uh, Tesco and ASOS, uh, Dixons and Curry's. Um, so we have very great capability in terms of using and delivering functionality to iPads and websites and all that type of thing, all of which is becoming uh, in much greater demand in healthcare, particularly when you're looking to deliver IT and services out to community workers, community nurses, social workers and everything else. So our offering to the NHS is very much around how to do, uh, do different with less, particularly in the cost constraints of times we're finding that um, a lot of our technology can be brought to bear within IT um, and reduce the ongoing costs by somewhere between 35 and 50 percent. Um, we have you know, lots, lots of activity in healthcare in particular at presently that, uh, that demonstrates all of that is possible, at the same time as delivering a much higher level of service um, back to the end users. So that's our, that's our primary offering. We're very much focused on how to do different with less and how to generate, uh, generate very, very significant cost savings with, with technology. From our perspective, the advantages we found from the uh, Healthcare Strategy Forum are probably uh, threefold. One of which is we're able to meet up with people that we're already engaged with, but in a, in a, in a less office-based environment, and therefore the conversations have been um, much more productive than they would if we were in an hour's slot for a meeting. Secondly, um, the very, very high profile of the uh, of the participants means that we are talking to decision makers, which means that our engagement is much more effective as a result. Um, and we've also find that. Um, it is a very, very focused event, um, not just from, the, our, from our supplier side, but also the participants are very clear about why they're here and what they're here to do, which makes engagement you know, across the board a, a very, very, um, very easy thing to do and a very, very, and, and we're therefore getting, you know, we, we're generating very good contact and I think business as a result of, of this healthcare strategy forum. So in terms of the way the, uh, the event is, uh, is established, we found you know, very real benefit from the very speed networking, which enabled us to get a whole set of introductions with a lot of people that we wouldn't necessarily have, uh, have met otherwise. Um, and that has generated follow-on in terms of conversations with planned meetings, the one-to-one -one meetings, conversations at dinner and at breakfast, um, and, you know, and, and in the social social. Uh, timings, uh, coffee breaks and that type of thing. Um, so they, they, that, that package has been very effective. We also generated lots of conversation and lots of interest um, off the back of the presentation that we gave, um, which again triggered more one-to-one -one meetings, both in the planned sessions and in, in, in coffee breaks and over, over, over dinner. So uh, as, a, as a whole package, I, I, you know, our experiences, um, both myself and, and the colleagues who have been here with me, have found it to be very, very effective. Um, and again, going back to the fact that you know, from a participant side, they know why they're here, and therefore the engagement is a, a much higher quality than we'd find in other events. In terms of uh, in terms of procurement and public sector procurement, um, there is always a role for dialogue, um, a bit competitive dialogue, or, or prior to that. And I think this is you know that this sits, this approach sits nicely within that process. Um, so as a result, you know any anybody who comes to market and seeks to engage with suppliers like us or anyone else, from a procurement perspective perspective, um, you know, the NHS and public sector as a whole have very clear procurement rules. I think where this event um, situ is situated within that is very clearly uh, from a, you know, when, when you're in initial dialogue and competitive dialogue um, and therefore it's a very valuable uh, activity both from a participant perspective because they would naturally want to go out and engage with 
various suppliers so they can clearly understand what's available in the market um, and therefore be very, very clear about what they want to procure when it comes down to procurement. So, um, so I think we find, uh, you know, within that context, it's a very, very powerful and useful event from that perspective. Uh, this is the first time we've done Health Strategy Forum. Uh, myself and my colleagues um, have found it you know, a very compelling event, very, very efficiently and effectively run, um, and both for ourselves and the delegates that we've um, interacted with, we've found, you know, we've found tremendous value. So I would, uh, I would definitely, uh, definitely recommend that uh, you know, other, other delegates and other people within the NHS consider this for the next event. It's been very, very well run and very, very, very popular and very, very effective from my, the feedback that I've gathered.